Hey guys, it's Amberly. So, a lot of people have been asking how exactly do snakes have sex? So, I'm going to show you. Here, we have a really nice lock between Emma and Grim. As you can see, their tails are entwined right at the cloacas. And they will do this anywhere from eight hours to three days or so. These two have been at it for about 36 hours or more. Hoping to get some good things out of this clutch. So that's what it looks like. And I'm going to explain a little more. So I'm going to use Lee here as an example. What? the snakes do <coughs> is connect themselves right here at the cloaca or the vent. Usually the males have larger spurs. Um, these are actually evolutionary leftovers of what could have been legs. They will use their spurs to kind of tickle the female into preparing themselves right here at this little vent is where everything goes in and comes out. Essentially you want to think of hemipenes as a pocket. Normally they're inside so you don't see them but when they're getting ready to breed they expose their hemipenes like an inverted pocket. So it is inverted, um, it goes in, but it pops out sort of backwards, or it's inside backwards. Now the female sex gland is just like a pocket, where the inverted hemipene just slips right in. It's very much like human biology, only there's two sets of each, two hemipenes, two sex glands. So I hope that clarifies um, how exactly snakes do the deed. Hope you guys learned something. If you have any comments or questions, feel free to put them in the comment section below. And I will see you guys next time. Hey guys, if you liked that video, check out our other videos. Also, don't forget to rate and subscribe and comment and all that down below. And Chester says please. Thank you.